Well, Mark, Weymouth on Tuesday. What's your thoughts ahead of the game? Another tough game. Um, obviously, no stranger to Weymouth. Um, a lot of familiar faces there. Uh, you know, a club I have the utmost respect for. We've, um, you know, went through a lot together. There's still a lot of my players that I brought into the club there who have, um, you know, are rightly heroes at that football club. Um, so a club I've got the utmost respect for, but because I've got the utmost respect for them, we'll be preparing even tough, even even sharper for them. Because of course, like you say, you have got a lot of history with the club, but ultimately you're with us now, and you want to sort of come back to them and prove that you know you you do have what it takes to get one over them on them, so to speak. Yeah, look, absolutely. You know, I'm a I'm older manager of Aldershot Football Club now, and that is my full focus, my only focus. And you know, we need to be getting getting the points on the board and in what is going to be a big game for us. But like I said, the, the respect ends at the final whistle and then it starts at the end of the whistle again on the final whistle. Because like I said, I've got huge respect for, for that club. Um, on giving me my opportunity and what we all achieved together um, was you know, a special, special time. But like I said, um, uh, we, you know, we move on. Um, I can always look back at those memories um, with, with, with fondness, but now I want to be creating new memories with all the shots. And looking at where we both are as sides in the league, you know, it's going to be ultimately an important game for us to both kick on in the league and kick on as we look to push up the table as well this season. Yeah, for sure. You know, every game is, is important. The next game is always the biggest, and that's certainly the case here. But, you know, like I said, we've always got to remain focused on, on our jobs, our roles and responsibilities, and our belief in the way that we want to do things. Um, you know, I'm a firm believer if we keep consistently working hard on the things that we think is going to give us the best chance of getting a result, ultimately we'll turn that into points. Another game short in quick succession back at home. How important is it to get that home form off and run and really look to kick on at home? Yeah, it's, it's vital. You know, the, the home form is, is something that we want to really make it a fortress. It's the old adage, but it's important that we, um, you know, we get points at home because um, we want to entertain our, our fans. Um, you know, there's nothing better than a rocking Aldershot Stadium. Believe me, I've, you know, I'm fortunate enough to play in front of it and uh, that's the atmosphere I want to be, be creating and it's up to us. You know, we need to give the fans something to respond to. I will be hoping still that these new signings that are continuing to come in, you know, can do that. You know, the likes of Torre as well will hopefully do that on Saturday, on Tuesday rather. Yeah, look, I think we're only going to get stronger. Um, like I said, you, the fruits of our work, um, you know, will we'll, we'll come along, will bear fruit, you know, as we go along. But it's important we have a short-term impact. We keep trying to pick up points because I think long-term, you know, I can see the vision here. I can see that we're... You know, I think we're going to be a strong side, but we've just got to make sure we manage this early part, um, steady the ship and put some strong foundations in to, to go onwards and upwards. Because of course, with the players that are already here as well and the competition that's now in place, you hope that the levels for them and their performances are also raise and we look to see ourselves push on this season. Yeah, absolutely. It's like, you know, training, you're playing against better players, more competition, it sharpens you in training, you improve. So yeah, competition is healthy. The standard's certainly gone up, um, you know, since we've been here, I think, in... Uh, you know, physically we're working harder, um, but ultimately the proof is on the pitch and we've got to make sure that we do that. And of course, with the quick turnaround in games, it's important that you keep a run going and it's consistent. You can hopefully, like I say again, push yourself up the table. Yeah, that's, you know, it's, it's, it's clear that we want to get ourselves clear as quick as we can, um, get safe and, and really start rolling out our, our philosophy in the way we want things done. But it's just getting that fine balance of uh, you know, getting points on the board and still growing, growing a football club.